What is up guys, it is Jenks here and I've got a hell of a lot to talk about so let's just get this straight in the way. I've just been watching the Microsoft conference over at E3 over at IGN.com and there is so much stuff I'm excited to announce. I've got it all written down in the notepad here. So first I'm going to talk about the major things, then I'm going to talk about the smaller games. So the first thing we saw in the E3 conference was some Modern Warfare 3 campaign gameplay and I've got to say it looked huge, it looked amazing. It looked absolutely insane. Um, I did note down some of the weapons that I seen whilst he was playing. We saw an AK-74U making its return, a P90, a AA-12, a G18, and maybe a Vector possibly. We're not too sure about that one, but it was really insane. I really enjoyed the Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. Can't wait for that. The the guy who works for Sledgehammer said this is the biggest COD yet, The campaign-wise. It's just going to be action-packed and it's going to be huge. Um, what else should talk about? There was a new Laura Croft, but I'll talk about that later. EA Sports came out and said that they're going. All the EA Sports games that are coming out are going to have Connect. Um, Connect is going to be compatible with it, which I know a lot of people aren't a fan of Connect, but it's going to really be a good thing. It's added features. So Tiger Woods is going to have golf swinging with Connect. Madden NFL, you're going to be able to call your plays through your Connect mic, and FIFA 12 is going to have Connect ability, but we're not too sure about that. He didn't say much about it. Um, what else have we got? On the big news front, Xbox Live, new Connect interface interface on the dashboard. It looks very nice, I've got to say. Uh, this is a big thing. YouTube is coming to Xbox Live. So now you can watch YouTube videos on Xbox Live. Not right now, obviously, but when they announce a date, that was just been announced. Also, Bing is coming on Xbox Live, a search engine for your Xbox. So if you've got Connect, you just say, like, Bing search, Call of Duty 4, and then it'll pop up Call of Duty 4, and you can just click it and play it. Pretty, pretty lazy, but still pretty awesome. Live TV, they said, is coming back. UFC is going to be live on Xbox as well. And you can actually like vote with other people to like say, hey, I think this guy's going to win this UFC match. And then if you win, you get points. You get put up on a leaderboard. That looked really cool. Oh, man, I'm talking too fast. There's so much to talk about. Oh, my God. <laughs> anyway, the next thing I want to talk about is Gears of War 3. Cliff Blazinski and Ice-T came out to play some campaign footage. You know, we've seen, it's basically we've seen all Gears of War 3. You've seen enough beta footage from you, but the campaign looks pretty awesome. Um, the one new thing I saw was, like, they get into this big robot suit with guns in, so that was an awesome thing. Uh, the next thing that came up was the Halo CE remake. Uh, it was just an epic trailer, like, 10 years and now. It's been digitally remastered in HD um, with with the multiplayer. So it's going to have multiplayer. Halo 1 is coming back. It's going to have multiplayer. It's going to be in HD. Uh, it's it's run on the Reach engine by the looks of things because I could see the Reach assassinations and stuff. So it looks very similar to Reach. I hope they don't change the gameplay too much because Halo 1 was the greatest Halo without a doubt. If you if you played it, you'll know. Um, then was Forza 4. Amazing graphics. Connect voice and head tracking and monthly expansions for Forza 4. Pretty much sums up, we already know a lot about Forza, it looks insane, I'm definitely going to be picking that up. Um, anyone who's a fan of Fable, a new Fable game's just been announced, Fable The Journey. It'll have Connect enabled, so you can like drive a horse and carriage with your Connect. Um, looks very responsive, i got to admit. Um, and you can like you can like cast spells or whatever you do in Fable using your hands, using Connect. So it's like first person now, instead of third person. I'm not sure if that's how the whole thing can be, I'll obviously give you a choice on that. Um, Oh, big news. Huge news. They just announced that Minecraft is coming to Xbox 360 exclusively this winter. Minecraft is coming, making its console debut exclusive to Xbox. Sorry for PS3 users, but wow. And it's going to be Kinect enabled. I'm not sure how that's going to run. I think it's still going to be better on PC because they're obviously more powerful, but we'll see. Not sure sort some shit out. Uh, next thing I saw that I saw that I thought was interesting was Star Wars Kinect. Um, Looks really awesome. You can use your force with, with your hands, and it's just all connect based. But it it does look real fun. I'm I'm probably gonna pick that up. Um, another thing, a connect guy just walked out and said, uh, connect fun labs where you can try out connect games that other people have made. Make your avatar look like you. Connect finger tracking so you can draw pictures with your fingers. Object capture so you can scan real life objects into the game. So like say say I get my HD PVR, I can scan it into the game. And then my virtual PVR will just be there and I'll be able to like run around with it, which is pretty awesome. Um, and the biggest thing that I'm most excited about, uh, you guys know I'm a big Halo fan. You know I'm a Halo fanboy, I've got to admit. Uh, the guy at Xbox, he just basically closed the conference and said, Before we go, we're going to show you a new project that we've been working on. It's going to be kicking off a new trilogy 
and then it just cuts to a black screen, a trailer comes up, and all you you see like sort of a blood blood pumping into a heart, you see a heart beating like oof, oof, oof. and then you hear Katana's voice, if you're similar with if you're familiar with the other Halo games, you hear Katana's voice and she's like, John, wake up John, John and then you wake up, your Master Chief, he's just standing there, the ship's blowing up. If you remember the end, end of Halo 3, you were in a ship and you've been like sort of frozen, but you like basically been put to sleep. So Katana's obviously waking you up because the ship's blowing up, some shit's going down, Covenant are going crazy. Master Chief's just there, his fucking guns, and oh, it looks so good. As a Halo fanboy like I am, it looked insane. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to Halo so much. Oh, I just jizzed. No, I'm joking, guys. Anyway, that's been the Microsoft conference. Uh, that's pretty much everything I wanted to talk about that was important during the conference. If you guys want to watch more, um, just head over to IGN.com. It's through from the 6th to the 9th of June, 2011. Peace out.